Halo Infinite has been delayed. Hi there, Scott Action Jackson here with a bit of video game news. Halo Infinite has been delayed to 2021 now. 343 Industries studio head Chris Lee has released a brief statement through the official Halo Twitter explaining the developer has made the difficult decision to delay Halo Infinite into 2021. And I'll have the image of the statement up here. And it is more or less just to make sure everything is has make sure everything has the adequate time to deliver the best possible game out there and of course the covid stuff that's going on throughout the world is affecting this so this this does mean that the halo infinite game will not be coming out at the launch of xbox series x or s if you want to get that now, this is understandable considering that they recently showcased some of the game itself and there was mixed reactions to it. So they do want to give it more time to make it and make, you know, improve on some things. To me, it's a bit upsetting that it won't launch with this new system. But then again, I say let them have time to work on it some more. And when the game, when the system launches, we're going to have a good handful of games come out. And not only that, but all the all the backwards games that we can use from the Xbox One and the Xbox 360 and the original Xbox that can be used on the Xbox Series X. Or at least the ones that they'll have available to use on it at the time when it launches. Because I'm guessing once the system launches, there's going, to, there's going to be tons of hiccups and... All kinds of stuff along the way within like the first 24 hour if not the first month but this is just me sharing this news along with my opinion on it in which case i'm like I, I i'm fine with them taking their time and making sure they make the best possible game that they can well this wasn't expected uh on top of the earlier announcement of halo infinite's delayed launch Microsoft has actually revealed that it will be releasing the Xbox Series X this November. We, we've always heard and known that it was going to be this holiday. We didn't really get much of a time frame. But now Microsoft has revealed a bit of a smaller time frame for us now with it being November. I guess we circle this down to maybe being closer to Black Friday. If not, maybe the middle of November? Yeah, there's all kinds of different areas that they could throw it in November. I mean, they don't even have to do it on Tuesday. They can do it on, like, a Thursday or a Friday. I forgot what day the systems came out last time. But it's like, okay, we got one thing figured out for one of the next generation systems. We got a November window. Now we just got to find out what Sony says and or the actual price, because... There's been lots of talks that Microsoft is going to have theirs be the cheapest one. Go ahead and give your opinions down below on this.